Hey everyone and welcome back. Today's video is the In or Out Declutter Polish Edition. This is going to be, what are we, an April update. So I'm just going to show you real quick the polishes I picked out for April. I will show you pictures so that you can see them on my nails and then just let you know my thoughts and if they're going to stay in my collection or go out of my collection. And at the end of the video I'll go ahead and I'll show you what I picked out for May. So for the first two, um, this one was Miracle Gel by Sally Hansen in the color Rosy Riveter. And then this is the one by Essence, the Gel Nail Polish in Indian Summer. The picture that you see, both of these took two coats. This is more of a darker pink and this is more of like a coral color. I like both of them. Um, I love the brush on, um, I want to say, I think it's this one, the Essence one. I love like these thicker paddle brushes. I, I, I love, I, I just, they go on really easy. It just only takes like a couple of swipes really to get the nail polish on. And yeah, and Sally Hansen's the same way. I just love these the thick uh, brushes. Uh, so anyway, I'm, I'm keeping both of them. They're both staying in the collection. Next is the nail polish by Spellbound, and this is an elixir. This was more of like a dusty rose mauve color. Again, this, oh no, this one actually took three coats. Um, but, you know, love the color. I really like the way that it wears, so I'm keeping this one too. The next two colors are, I have to look at my little note, sorry. This one is by LA Colors Color Craze in Dimple. And I just saw somewhere, I think on Instagram, that now LA Colors is doing a gel nail polish formula. So, uh, if any of you guys have tried that out, let me know how you like it and how much they are. Um, but that's this one. And then uh, this is the Color Stay Gel Envy in Joker's Wild number 640. So that is these two right here. Um, they both took three coats. Hold on, I'm looking. Okay, sorry, I had to look real quick. They both took three coats. This probably could have taken a fourth coat. Um, this is more of like an orange sherbet color, and this is more of like a coral color. Um, but I do like this. I was on the fence with this one um, because it does take so many coats, but it is like a true sherbet orange, and I don't really have anything else like it, so I really, I'm going to go ahead and keep it. So I'm keeping these two. All right, the next two. This is by Revlon Colorstay, and this is in the number 140, Full Mood. And then this is Revlon in the color T Totally Toffee, number 415. So that's these two. They both took two coats. I like both of these colors, so I am going to keep them both. This has a lot of like shimmer in it, so I really like that. Um, and I don't know, I just, ah, I picked them out for this uh, for April. I don't know why, because it's not normally like a color I would go for. But um, I really did like using them, and they're beautiful fall colors, so I'm keeping both. And the last one is by Sally Hansen. This is the color Champagne. Um, I did have this in like a project, I believe it was last year. I think when I was doing trying to do the nail polish project, I put this in. Um, so yeah, I'm like, I don't know if you can see that, but I'm like right over here with this. Um, this was another one I was on the fence with. It <sighs> took two coats, but it is. It's very like Champagne-y, um, Frosty-like. Uh, but I did like the way that it looks. I think it's a pretty spring color, even summer, but like very Easter-y, like around that time. So I am going to go ahead and keep it this time around. So those are my picks for April. This was, I think, the first month that I didn't get rid of anything or I'm not passing along anything. But like I said, I really like the way that they all looked. And unless I really can't stand something, I'm going to keep it for right now. So that is that. Now I'll go ahead and show you my picks for May. So I picked out eight nail polishes. So the first one is LA Colors Color Craze in the color Secret. And this is actually what I'm wearing right now. Love this color. I have nothing like this in uh, my little stash. So I really, really like this color. So that's this right here. Uh, the next color is by Vinique. And this is in the color... Diamond Kisses. So it's a really nice, like, blue, baby blue. I don't know if you would say baby blue, but very nice blue color. 
Next one is by Sally Hansen. This is the Blue Away. This is probably more of a baby blue, yeah. That color. This is by Wet n Wild. Mega Last in the color Undercover. So that's this color here. Next is, and this I actually posted a picture on Instagram. Um, this is by Revlon. This is in the number 495 in the color Sultry. Love this color. It's like a bluish purple. It's more purple, but depending on how the light hits it, you can see some like uh, blue in it. So it's a very, very pretty color. I love it. Uh, the next one is by Ellie Color Craze, or Ellie Colors Color Craze in the color Interstellar. This is a uh, purple, has a lot of, uh, looks like it has like a lot of like silver, like little glitter in it. Next is by Nicole by OPI, and this is in the color, let's see, on what grounds. So again, this is like sort of like a bluish, greenish color, but it has some flux in there. So that is that. And then the last one I picked out is by LR. LR, I seriously, I can't, every month I can't say this name. It's LA Colors, Color Craze, in the color Timeless. So again, it looks like more like of a, like a dusty rose type of a color. So those are my picks. So again, didn't do too great with, you know, passing anything along. But every month I really have been um, putting aside at least one to three nail polishes I think I've been getting rid of. So this is the first month I haven't gotten rid of anything. So I'm totally okay with that. I'm excited about wearing these colors for May, and uh, that is it. I will obviously have a follow-up video at the end of May to let you know which ones stay in, which ones are going out, and then my picks for June. So uh, thanks for watching. If you guys are doing these kinds of videos, please let me know so I can stop by and see how you're doing. And until next time, I hope you guys are having a blessed day. Bye, guys. Mwah.